We are here in Dortmund at the Signal Iduna Park. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Bundesliga action is on our menu today. Borussia Dortmund against Freiburg. Well, I think the first 10 minutes might tell us how this match is going to pan out. Who can gain the upper hand? Who can get hold of this ball and ask all the questions? Referee uh, satisfied everything's OK, and off we go. This is the Borussia Dortmund lineup. In goal, Roman Berkey. Mats Hummels plays alongside Dan Axel Zagadou at the back. Axel Witzel starts with Emre Chan in central midfield. And they're starting, interestingly, with three forwards. Freiburg, a check on their starters for you. And it does look as though the opposition have gone like for like here with a similar 3-4-3 three, three setup. Should be really interesting to see which prevails now. I just wonder whether the opposing manager, this manager, has changed his formation to match up. Tries the shot. Well, they've gone for it right from the off, and they've got their reward with an early opening goal here. He's tucked it away, well out of the goalkeeper's reach. I love to see that. Don't have to whack it from that kind of position. Just side-footed home. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Gunter working the opposition over a little bit here with their passing. Axel Witzel. Sancho. Lovely, incisive pass. That's got him out. Rice! Oh, they've got another one! Very much quick-fire football from these boys. They've scored again. Restarting at 2-0. Sancho. Chan. Royce. Emre Chan. Maybe he'll cross it here. Fritzl. He saved it and saved it well. That'll be a corner. Corner swung in. That's frustrating to the coaches to see a corner there defended at the front post so easily. Really trying to win possession here. No threat now. He's still going. Fine run, this. Coming really deep as a forward to get on the ball. His teammates really telling him to get up the pitch. Too close to the keeper in the end. The hosts have controlled possession here so far. And it's been a really impressive performance, the way they've used the width of the pitch. They've swung some really good crosses in. Trying to slip it through. Now it's Ashraf Hakimi. Oh, they thought they were in, but the flag has gone up. Schmidt. Habera. And he gets it back. Yannick Habera. Aiming at the near post here with a cross. Saved, but not decisively. Could score! Well, they have cleared the danger. It was a decent opportunity, I think. Vincenzo Grifo. 
Patterson. A bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. With great vision here. Brilliant goal! Two for him on the day, and two very well taken goals. Well, here we go again, and they can't wait to get the ball back from the kickoff and try and get another one. Marco Royce. This does look promising. Just stole it away in the end, the goalkeeper. Well, two more minutes to play, that of added time. He's won it back easily. So we've reached the break. 3-0, the half-time score. Really was a very one-sided first half, and the... Team on the wrong end of that scoreline has got to show a bit of backbone now. Gunter. Excellent interception. Trying to thread a pass through, but not successful. Royce. He's lost the ball. Griffo. Christian Gunter. Vincenzo Griffo. Comes to get it to feet. He's come rather deep to do that. The main striker. Won it back with an interception. Marco Royce. This could be it. Shots on here. Keeper has reached it and rescued his side. Well, at this rate, we could be in double figures. Continue to create chances at a fantastic rate. Those strikers, I'm sure, they've never had so many opportunities. Well, we're two-thirds of the way through the 90 minutes. Half an hour to go. The build-up is patient. And he's seen the shot. And the keeper doing his job. Emre Chan, Jaden Sancho, Rafael Guerrero, Royce, Guerrero. He's going to try it. It's another one for them. They go further in front and they are full value for this position. Well, that's put them further in front and nicely taken. Certainly was, and uh, they seem to be heading for a comfortable lead here. So they restart again, a bit demoralised now, I think, in a game like this. Substitute coming up for the away team. Marco Royce. Chance from the pass. It comes out off the goalkeeper. Well, they managed to get out of harm's way then because it looked as though there was going to be some real damage done to them. He's going to make a change, and it's clearly a tactical one. There doesn't seem to be any injury involved. And there's the interception. It's a good pass in behind the defenders. With his skill, here's a chance to have a run at goal. Well, it is merely a consolation here. Yeah, no wonder he isn't celebrating. They've got the better of him at last. Not an easy thing to do. I feel a bit sorry for the keeper. He's kept everything else out. Well, he's been doing his bit. I think it's his defenders that need looking at. Left him exposed. So we restart again. 4-1.
That uh, goes down on his uh, record as a goal in this division, and he'll be pleased with scoring that. But for the general outcome, it's uh, I've got scant influence on that. No, none at all. But I actually think the winning manager will be uh, he'll be annoyed in that dressing room afterwards because off the keeper, back into play. No, the opportunity didn't really uh, manifest itself, and it's a goal kick. Pedersen. Pedersen. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. And the referee has acknowledged the flag from his assistant and given the offside. Well, they're going to shuffle the pack a bit now. We've got eight more minutes of the 90. Habera. Threads it through. Pushed out by the goalkeeper, but only into a dangerous area. You can see what he was trying to do, opening up his body to place it, but he's placed it wide, sadly, for him. Referee's had a good look and decided from what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Chan. Saw that coming and intercepted. Well, they're going to start from the back because it's a back pass to the keeper. Rafael Guerrero. And the referee has now called a halt. Borussia Dortmund have done the business in front of their own fans. They usually do, and they didn't disappoint us in this match. Yes, another exceptional performance, and we've seen quite a few of those on this ground this season.